Hey everyone, can you answer this physics GCSE question? When the volume of a gas in a syringe was 45 centimeters cubed, the pressure gauge showed a value of 60 kilopascals, KPA. Calculate the pressure in the gas when the volume of the gas in the syringe was 40 centimeter cubed. Right, in order to tackle this question, we've got to use the following formula. P1 times by V1 is equal to P2 times by V2, because the pressure in one scenario times by the volume in one scenario will be equal to the pressure in the second scenario times by the volume in the second scenario over here. So P1 times by V1 is equal to P2 times by V2. Then we're going to plug the numbers in. So look guys, we're going to do pressure 1, okay, 60, so 60 kilopascal times by the volume 1 of 45 centimeter cube will be equal to the final pressure, the final pressure, which is going to be P2, we're trying to find that out guys times by 40 centimeter cubed because now it's 40 centimeter cubed over here. Rearranging this, P2 is equal to 60 times by 45 divided by 40. And our answer is going to be, the final pressure is going to be 60 times by 45 divided by 40 is going to be 67.5 kilopascals. And that's going to be our 67.5 kilopascals here. And if you're still struggling in GCSE physics, why don't you check out my YouTube channel, which has hundreds and hundreds of videos to support you in your studies. Ciao, ciao, and goodbye.